Hello and welcome everyone. In this video, I will be demonstrating how to exploit a browser. So for that, we will be using a Beef XSS tool. So Beef XSS stands for Browser Exploitation Framework and XSS stands for Cross-Site Scripting. XSS is a one of the top 10 uh, OS vulnerabilities. And why we are using XSS over here is uh, we will be including a JavaScript uh, script in our uh, website code. And once the user opens our uh, website, so his uh, browser will be in our control. So in order to use Beef XSS, first we'll have to install the Beef XSS. And in order to install Beef XSS, first we have to update our system. So I'll just uh, update. I have already uh, updated it. So maybe our uh, output will not be same. Now we will install the beef accesses package. So for that, I will write a command. I have already installed it beef uh, accesses tool. So once again, our output of the screen will not be same. It will download some of the packages in your system if it is not installed. And if it is installed, then we can directly use it. So it says this access is already in the newest version. So in order to start, we can just give this access in our terminal and press enter. So it says open opening web UI and in 54321. So it will open a web browser. And uh, when you give uh, this access for the first time, it will ask you to uh, change your password. So just enter a password. And in this page, the user, the default username is beef. And the password is the password which you entered in the terminal. So I'll just enter my password. So we have uh, logged in into the beef term, uh, portal. And over here, we can see online browsers and offline browsers. Let's get started and now uh, we'll be creating a, a HTML page and we'll be displaying it uh, using uh, Apache. So we'll be using Apache web server to display the web page. So let's first start the Apache service. So I'll do service Apache 2 and then start. So our Apache service has been started. And I will just go to cd slash f slash www slash html. Over here, you can see that uh, index.html page will be there. So I will just print out the code for uh, index.html. So you can see that I have written a custom HTML code over here. Uh, in your case, this code won't be there, so uh, just delete the previous uh, index.html and create a new uh, index.html with your desired code. And in order to see this code, so I'll use ifconfig command. And uh, we have started our Apache 2 server. So what it will do is it will uh, display whatever the content uh, present in slash var slash www slash html uh, directory on this IP address. So I will just copy this IP address and paste it in the browser. Press enter. So we can see that uh, our uh, web page is shown in the browser. So I'll just go back. Uh, in the beef accesses terminal, just scroll up, and over here we can see that uh, web UI uh, on this uh, link our beef accesses is work, uh, working. And over here we can see that hook and uh, script is given. And uh, let's copy this, uh, go to uh, go to slash var slash www channel. I will edit my index.html code. So I'll just use nano index.html. And over here, I will paste the code. And 
in the place of IP address, I will just enter my IP address. So I'll press Control S and Control X to exit. So I'll press Control X and once again I'll go to browser and just refresh it. So in the beef control panel, we can see that online browser and our uh, IP address of Kali Linux machine is listed over here. So if we if we close uh, this tab and this tab also, so uh, it will go to offline browser. We can see that the page has been listed out as offline browser. So once again, I will just open it. And we can see that it has been listed as online browser. So I'll just click on it. So over here, we can see the information of our uh, browser. So all the information will be listed out over here. And then I will go to uh, commands tab. Over here, we can see that uh, all the uh, exploitation tools have been listed out. So now, in order to test our browser exploitation, I have uh, started another uh, VM, uh, Ubuntu 64-bit. And in this VM, I will be testing the browser exploitation. So I have opened a new browser and uh, pasted the link of our uh, website in this uh, browser. So for uh, this exercise, you can use any other VM or you can just use your uh, host window. So in the beef control panel, you can see that the IP address of my uh, Ubuntu system has been listed over here. On stack, uh, we can see the social engineering. So I'll just open it and scroll down. Over here, you can see uh, Google phishing. So I'll just click on Google phishing. And in the XSS uh, hook URL, I just use GPS. And I will press execute. So in the Ubuntu, uh, in the Ubuntu system, uh, we can see a username. I will give my email address. And the password, I will give as password. I will click on sign in. So it will just uh, redirect to uh, google.com website, whatever we had entered. And uh, in this terminal, you can see that uh, result username is uh, this one and the password is this one. So this is another way of uh, doing a phishing attack. And the most important thing with uh, browser exploitation is most of the things do, will not work in uh, beef uh, framework because the browser uh, updates very regularly and they uh, try to minimize the vulnerabilities. And if the browser uh, is very, very old, so most of these uh, exploits will work. But if the browser is current one or new one, so most of the uh, exploits will not work. So thanks for watching this video. If you have enjoyed this video, then uh, like it and subscribe to my channel.